I guess it's, there's two lenses on it. There is me as a person thinking what's in it for me or being driven by that instinct. Yeah. And there's also me having been aware of that past and you in the past and using that as a kind of, and I'm not sure motivation at all is even the right way to put it. Cause you can look at it that way that, you know, if you get the right kind of what's in it for me indicators, you can get better engagement from people if you're trying to do something. But actually I think it's a base requirement. I think if you don't have something that triggers people's what's in it for me, or you're not even cognizant of that, you're, you're not going to get what you need if you're looking to roll out something at work or get your friends interested to do things or gain engagement or something if there's not something in it for people you're not going to get that and i think not being aware of that is could be a big problem for people and a big thing why sometimes things don't work so i always try to be very aware of this concept and draw people i was gonna say draw people in but get people involved by thinking what would draw them, what's what's the motivating factor, what will give them a sense of self-worth, what gives them something in return, where does their value come in, and make sure that is strongly embedded in a, in a part of whatever you're doing. Um, and like you referenced there, Ryan, sometimes that can be quite overt. Sometimes you directly spell that out to people, and sometimes it can be more subtle and yeah. it becomes that you know so there's there's a, there's a thing you, that, that's talked about in in work as a very simple terms a, a phrase i've used which is you know peer pressure is a great motivator but it's it's the same thing that drives as we all know we talked before i'm a great Fortnite player and you tick off challenges or there's a leaderboard i was doing some things on there called death runs the other day which are challenge things and it tells you who the top three people are that have progressed and i was really driven by getting myself onto that top three then to second then to first because there's that competitive edge to it, and that can be a what's in it for me driver. Or you might be in a job yeah. where you have a bonus scheme, and that's a what's in it for me driver. So there's 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 all those sort of things there that I say I'm aware of, and I guess I touched in there as well how it it drives me. And I think that competitive edge, whether it's against other people or it's against myself to do better, is is definitely something that drives me, and it it fits in that bracket completely. <laughs> <laughs>